Papa, consider my heart. Consider my emotions. Consider my happiness here yeah. to be inside me. Wow. Make I belong, make I belong. Oh, where go? Put a little link, put a little link. Connect me more. Make I belong, make I belong. Oh, where go? Put a little link, put a little link. Connect me more. When talk you enter money, the money is a love me. When talk you enter money, oh, na di we buo. Make I belong, make I belong. Oh, where go? Put a little link, put a little link, connect me more. Pride and power can be found at your ego. Make a connection. Haven't you heard of uh, First Mora TV? Home of Nollywood movies. Mm -hmm. Subscribe now. First Nolly TV. Don't talk that. Consider my emotions. Consider my happiness here yeah, to be inside me. Wow. Make I belong, make I belong. Oh, where go? Put a little link, put a little link. Connect me yeah, more. Make I belong, make I belong. Oh, where go? Put a little link, put a little link. Connect me yeah, more. When talk you enter money, the money is a long way. When talk you enter money, oh, on a deep web. Make I belong, make I belong, oh, where go? Put a little link, put a little link, connect me yeah, more. Pride and power can be found at your ego. Make a connection. Come to that, make I belong. The ones who get pride and power can be found at my ego. Make a connection. Come to that, make I belong. The ones who get pride and power can be found at the castle of one. Make a connection. Come to that, make I belong. Pride and power can be found at your ego. Make a connection. Come to that, go
Well, be for now. It should be in your best interest to state the reason you are here quickly. Mm. Be careful what you wish for. King Inabuike Wobodo, paramount ruler of Amikulu Kingdom. If you look closely, you will notice that I'm not here for a random visit. Rather, I am here to warn you to desist. Yes, you will be stepping on toes that will destroy you and whatever you stand for. Don't make me regret ever allowing you into these premises in the first time. For the avoidance of doubt, I am the king. I rule here. And you do not threaten me in my own territory. And coming here with your stupid pride and cheap cigar to rub insults on me and in my palace, it's really the height of it. Get out of my palace now. A person who sells eggs should not start a fight in the market. And same goes for the man who marries a beautiful woman and lives her on the streets. And the farmer who decides to foolishly grow his corn along the roadside, they have the same problem. Exactly. Ignorance. The deadly disease ever. If I were you, I will look before I leap. <laughs> You know, when the mouse laughs at the cat, let it not forget that there is a hole nearby. It will soon be buried in it. But be for now. Let me warn you. Water may cover the footprints on the ground, but will never cover the words of the mouth. Be careful. Choose your words wisely. King Nabuike. Country the lions have their own history. The hunt will always celebrate the hunter. <laughs> you just grabbed a front seat in hell. Get out of my palace! I warn you. For the last time, I will soon ask the boys to embarrass you. Again, I'm late today. Oh, goodness. Um, this can wait. Why is this girl not speaking up? Cassandra. Hi, Mom. Who hears the phone ring is expected to pick up. 
Because you never can tell if there's emergency. Come on, mommy. It's too early for complaints right now. Cassandra, at least you would have acknowledged my call all through the night. I was trying to reach you. Your father and I are worried. We've been trying to reach you on phone, Cassandra. I'm getting set for work. It's been six months you last visited us. When are you paying us a visit? Hmm. Not in the nearest future, Mom. The work here is so hectic. I don't even have time for little social lives. That's if you understand what I mean. It seems this your job is beginning to cloud your sense of responsibility, Cassandra. Mother, are we doing this right now? Come on, I told you I'm getting set for work. Okay, do not worry yourself. I'll call you back in the next two hours, okay? Don't you dare hang up on me. Because if you do, I'll fly down there and knock some lessons into you. Nonsense. Hello? Hello? What is wrong with this girl? your nose. You see they leave for this town? What, what is going on? Why are you embarrassing me? Okay, you still have mouths to ask questions. Eh? All this while you've been avoiding my calls, my text messages. The worst is you refuse to pay me my money that you're owing me. Huh? Eh? Take it easy, madam. What is happening here? Don't tell me to take it easy, oh. This man has been owing me. He's been owing me for months now. He doesn't want to pay. Oga, okay. have you carried our overnight nice, you no know, pay her? Excuse me, do I look like that kind of woman? Please, oh, mind your mouth. Look, oh, I was on my own as she came to me that she wants to sell her iPhone. I said, okay, while we were bargaining, I told her I don't have the complete money because I've not received my salary yet. She said, no problem, that I should give her the one that I have. And I gave her the one that I have and promised that I will pay her back later. The balance. I don't know the, this embarrassment. And since then, you know, pay. Good question. Answer the question. It wasn't intentional. I was sacked from my job. And I appealed to her to give me little time to run around and raise the money and offset the balance. Why is she embarrassing me on the street like this? Okay, eh? Nile. As the case may be, you have seen him. Forgive him now. Let him run around and look for the money and pay you. Please. Please. You can't embarrass me. You are lucky someone just intervened on your behalf. I'm giving you next week. Next week, oh, no. if by next week I don't see my money, what I will do to you, you won't believe it. No try me. No Best guy, try and look for her money by next week. Pay her to avoid this embarrassment on the road. Okay? No Please. No problem. She be wife again. But to she not the look at your face, yeah. Uh, if you like her, she go like you. Run for her trouble. Uh. She not the look at your face, yeah. Make her not come see her. Young girl, they sleep, yeah. Now so trouble, come wake up. Uh. She be one for you. Run for your life. If you want trouble, you can see one person. What happened? Oh my goodness. Look at your shirt. Hey! Wait, do not tell me you've gone to fight again. Not really, but see eh? The way I did now, anybody will look for my trouble will collect. If you do any, you will see any. I already leave mark for that person body. Huh. That is if they do not hit you first. Do anything. not forget, uh. you are a woman and you should behave like one. I beg you. Mind you that you are in the parcel department. Go check if some parcels have arrived. Oh, are you, sir? <laughs> Princess of my great kingdom. Princess Cassandra. Princess of our kingdom. The most beautiful princess of all the princesses. 
Please, what can I do for you this morning? Do you know yesterday night? In my dreams, I, I, I saw myself. I knew I was kissing somebody. I was about proposing to somebody. There was a ring, but there was no finger. Hey, hey, hey. hey. It's too early for that. I Let me tell you the truth. I, I, I don't have time for this. Huh? I have to learn around, please. Hello? Can you concentrate on me? Hello? No problem. We'll keep trying luck. <laughs> this is just the first take. Oh. I must marry you. Me and you. We die for this airport. Nonsense. So you have to hold on for a while. Our systems are down. And moreover, this flight has been rescheduled for 6 p.m. You say what? What supposed flight has been rescheduled? Are you normal? Did you give me pre-notice? Pre what kind of people are there? Is that how you work here? Do you have PR? Do you know how to call PR? Do you know how to relate to customers? Did you tell me you rescheduled my flight? Don't tell me to come down. Sorry, apologies, sir. What's wrong? Sorry, are you the manager? Because I'm pissed off right now. What is going on here? I have a flight to catch and no one is saying anything. What, what do you mean you're a shadow? Oh, um, I sincerely apologize for the inconveniences this delay might have cost you. All we are here to do is to serve you better. As the wings of Nigeria, we want the best for you, sir. So sorry. Oh, shut up. You have nothing to offer. Your utmost priority is rubbish. Do you know what I'll be losing if I'm not on that flight? Do you know the business I have? Do you know my schedule? But sir, we've already apologized to mm. you. I really don't understand why you are making a fuss out of this. Excuse me? Um, Excuse me! Angela, calm down. He's our customer. I know he's our customer, but he needs to understand we are humans. Oh. And this situation is beyond our control. So sir, please, if you don't mind, have a seat over there. When we're ready for you, let you know oh, where your you, flight is boarding. Oh, will you shut up? Or you take a seat with your overmaker? What is wrong with you? How do you, how do you employ her? Who, who, who do you think you are? Did you know who you're talking to? How dare you challenge me? Are you alright? How did you employ this dumb brain to work in this kind of establishment? I'm sorry sir, but she did not challenge you. Neither did I. She only told you the whole truth. Huh? Well, underneath this borrowed wig of yours lies a small brain with low capacity to absorb sense of respect for the elite. It's really unfortunate that you do not know I am not your wreck. It's really unfathomable and so shameful that a man of your capacity and exposure would stoop so low as to rain curses on women. That shows how less of a man you are. If you will excuse me. Hey, 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 hey. Hey. Look at her. With your oversized shoes. Oversized shoes. 
oversized shoes. Hey, so what am I going to do now? I'm sorry, here's your ticket. When it's boarding, we'll let you know. What's going to happen now? Uh, um, do you have a luggage? Are you blind? Take it, see? Um, sir, please, can you bring it over here? to win abuses on me. Hmm. He should thank his star that I am not groomed to be abusive. You know, that man doesn't, you know, that man doesn't even strike me like someone who has a woman in his life. And even if he does, maybe someone like Angela. Who? who? I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg. Marry who? That guy can be my husband. Though. If that guy is my husband, by now I would have finished him with mouth and my, my, my hand. Very annoying guy. In fact, he needs a wife like you, Gally Queen like you. Ah, I want the meaning of Gally Queen. Uh, my sister, I heard this from all these hair hostels. You know, they will carry their head like... You know, one of these days, you're going to borrow a word that will cause your tongue to be cut off. Oh, and please. We'll check dictionary for the meaning. Hey! Check our pankies! When I stay there around, what are the gallivant up and down they find for this airport? The gallivanting queen calling us gallivant. Mm. Let's go, go. go. No, oh, gally queen. So, so stop calling me that rubbish. <laughs> um, please, uh, Princess Kasa, can you do this handsome young underage man a favor and take me back to my house, please? Oh, Jesus Christ. So, of all the ladies here, you did not see anyone to ask for it. This was a woman. What a young woman, I love you. I'm in so much in love with you. Gali Queen, I'm off. Enjoy your boyfriend. Please, I'm right behind you. Enjoy with your boyfriend. I am right behind you. What did I want to talk? You must have lost it. What did they tell him? You must have lost it. You're not serious. If you need money for taxi, I'll give you. I'll gladly give you. Hello? Pray? Please, can you concentrate on me? Pray? I wonder where she was rushing to. My dear, that is none of my business. Everyone has their own problem. As for me, I am having the best time of my life. I mean, there is no better place to wind off than here and now. I'm telling you, my sister, this is it. Like they say, all work and no play makes Jack a dull boy. <laughs> Realize that all work and no play makes Jack a dull boy. Mm. Ah! <laughs> Let's call this pay this pay, though. <laughs> oh. My sister, tell her. Thank God that you are here, because if you weren't here, I'm sure Angela must have bored me to death. <laughs> hmm. Sorry, oh. sorry for boring you guys. Oh. I didn't know it was that boring. Mm. Hmm. Who is that? Family, of course. My mom. Then answer. It might be very important, you know. My dear, there is no problem. I know my mother. 
She just asked me to come back home. I'm no longer a child. Oh, everybody with their own wife. Jesus. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm telling you. My husband, Jonas, will kill me today. Jonas will kill me. Jonas will kill me. I didn't know it's this late. Oh my god, oh my god, Jonas will kill me today. Please, I'm going. I'm going on the marry woman. I got that. I have to. I have to. Okay. Hi. Am I forgetting anything? Is that my it's okay, just go. Bye bye. Yes, but you don't die. Person just get like, confused like this because of marriage. Also, marriage make person they be. Hey, hey, hey. Thank God for single life. Oh. Single life is beautiful. Listen, if you day single, you go gang gang. You don't understand? It's not pure if you're married now. You can't run around, they, 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 they do cooking, they do laundry for one year, yeah, man. How? You go say you're married, you know if you breathe. You say make you breathe small, you go to choke. You go to, they, go to, they go to ask you to breathe, you go, to, you go to choke, you go to small time, you go, you go, you go choke, you go choke, you so then you go, bye. Babes, as I day like this, I did enjoy my single food. I spread. I beg, I don't want you to go choke me, oh. As I day like this, I gang gang like this. Sometimes you talk as if you're not a woman, Mabel. One day, you must certainly get married. And I shall remind you of today. I beg you, you marriage help. Mm, Bone that thing. Where are you coming from by this time of the night? Um, I... Have you forgotten you have a husband to serve a dinner? Uh, honey, I... Okay, let me just hurry up and get the food. I mean, it's just 8 p.m. <laughs> 8 p.m. Did I hear you say 8 p.m.? <laughs> eh? Honey, I'm sorry. I... When are you supposed to come back in the first place? I, 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 I... A married woman like you. You are just coming back by this time of the night? I'm sorry. Eh? I'm sorry. So you are supposed to sleep over there? No, 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 sir. Eh? No, sir. 8 p.m. No, sir. Instead of you to be remorseful of what you did, you are justifying your action. You are telling me 8 p.m. The lion himself, of Biafu Nigeria, the ambassador himself, of Biafu Nigeria. Lion begets lion. <laughs> <laughs> Son, welcome back. Thank you, Father. Good to see you. <sighs> I was not expecting you this soon. How did the signing ceremony go? I hope it went as planned. Of course, Father. Everything was a success. Good. <laughs> I couldn't contain the excitement. I had to take the next available flight back home to give you the good news. <laughs> you always make me a proud father. I don't have a choice. <laughs> <laughs> Although I am not surprised. I'm not surprised because you are just like me, the chief of the old block. <laughs> Following my post. I have no choice, <laughs> And I'm grateful for that. Yes. See that? Yeah. I have something to discuss with you. Uh, <clears throat> oh, you see, my son. When a young man grows, people will ask, How are you? And when he becomes an adult, People will ask, how is your family? I don't understand what you're doing. Yes, um, I want you to take Princess Cassandra, daughter to the king of Amekulu kingdom, as your wife. Really? 
in this jet age, father. Come on. You didn't consider my opinion before making such decisions? Listen, father, I am an adult. Old enough to make my own decision, especially when it comes to picking a wife. <laughs> Maybe I should let you know why I want you to marry her. But do I? Get yourself refreshed. We've had a long day. We'll talk about this later. We'll talk more. Once again, welcome back. <laughs> I don't understand. There are too many clauses in this agreement. Now we go over there. That is why I'm here to answer your question as concerning that agreement. If I back row your ambition to become the king of Amekulu kingdom, my son marries your daughter. I am really concerned. I'm concerned about these two people you're talking about. Your son and my daughter. I... Listen, I, I don't have any problem, you know, being in-laws with you. I mean, it should be a pleasure. But... These people are grown. They are adults. I would prefer they are let out of this. Let them be able to make their own choices themselves. It is best to allow them. My son hears my voice. I want to give others your things. You should be in control of your household. Talking to your daughter should be a walkover. <sighs> Ambassador, make no mistakes, I'm in control of my household. But there is a limit to which you can control an adult. Choice is one of those limitations. Yes, I want to become king. But at the detriment of the choice of my daughter. Nabuke, son of Mwobudo, sign this document. <laughs> Ambassador, on <I'm> trust. <laughs> How you are talking. <laughs> I'll get a copy of this for my records.
Yes. Now we are illos. Which is <laughs> King Fist. Yes. A brighter future. <laughs> right now, your opinion is not important. It is my job to make sure you take decisions that will improve your life and position you for a greater height. Father, well, this doesn't make sense to me at all. I mean, you can do your business without involving marriage. So, the pen that writes your life story is in your hand. And the clue of recent has become the darling of oil checks in this country and beyond her shores. Simply because of the deposits of blue light crude oil discovered in large quantity in their kingdom so i made him sign all the dotted lines look son your marriage to the princess will not only make you royalty but will give you the power and the control over all oil companies. King Uobodo has been bombarded with proposals from oil companies. Okay. But this is going to be a little difficult, I mean. Never met this girl in person. You've met. Both of you used to be playing dates while growing up. This is kind of reunion. Yes. Father. Father, why don't you just place your offer to this kingdom? He might be considerate. Look, son. The pessimist sees difficulty in every opportunity, while the optimist sees opportunity in every difficulty. So think about it. Haven't you heard of uh, Fresh Molly TV? Home of Nollywood movies. Subscribe now. Fresh Molly TV. Don't talk about it.